Welcome back, everybody. My name is All Funny Games. I stream every day on Twitch TV, and I also do fun little videos here on YouTube. I'm going to showcase a mod that I forgot to actually mention. Well, this is a mod that sometimes can get in the way of other situations, for example, betas and mods and stuff. So you've got to be a little bit cautious with us because I find that the Craft Pop mod sometimes does cause a little bit of bugs for me when, like I said, a beta comes out or a new update comes out and, you know, the it's just not ready for the new recipes. That being said, the mod I'm talking about is called the Craft Pop mod. Now, if you don't know exactly what it does, I'm going to give you a little showcase. So as you open up your crock pot, you're going to see on the on the right hand side, a new craft menu is going to show up. And basically what it does is it's going to showcase exactly what happens when you put some ingredients together. So if I start adding ingredients, it's going to say, if I add all these all together, I'm going to make matzo lasagna. Not only does it show you what you're about to be crafting in the crock pot, it's also going to tell you the stats. It's going to remove 20 sanity, 20 HP, but give you 37.5 hunger. This mod is amazing. If you don't really know how to craft anything in Don't Starve Together, this mod will tell you exactly what you're going to be making. It'll also tell you the probability of you making a, a, a specific meal as well. So sometimes if you go to make something, there's like a 50-50 chance that you're either going to make uh, something good or something bad. So that'll also tell you the probability behind that. But if you want to make just generic little tiny little things, you know, like pierogies and whatnot, um, and you're also trying to learn new recipes, this will tell you exactly what you need in order to make the other recipes by obviously telling you what you might be missing. For example, it's telling us that we are missing, uh, in order to make spicy chili, we're missing 1.5 meat so we would need another little piece of another little morsel in there not making two because then we're obviously going to have more uh monster meat being made but if we wanted to also add a little bit more veggies in there the same idea so it just basically is letting us know that okay if you do want to make some other things you you are missing a few ingredients um if you want to make mushy cake and all that other stuff it basically tells you everything that you're missing and what you need what you need in order to craft um you know said recipe so it's always nice to actually know you know what you're going to be crafting i use this all the time not necessary because obviously i know the basic um i know the basic recipes to make on the crock pot but it's always nice and cool to see like hey look oh yeah this is exactly how to make it i'm not going to ac accidentally make um some wet goop or some mozzarella lasagna so if you are out there and you're trying to learn the crock pot menu um and trying to learn how to learn all the recipes from the crock pot and all that other stuff. This mod will help you get down that path. Um, it also kind of just helps you kind of get used to like remembering things too. Like I found that, um, I found that depending on like exactly what you're trying to make, for example, if you were trying to make like ice cream and stuff, um, it keeps reminding you of the missing ingredients. So eventually down the road, you know, it's something that you could leave this mod on all the time. It's not going to hurt anything. Um, obviously, some people might find that, oh, well, you know what, you're not te technically learning them how to make the recipes yourself in all honesty i think it's fine i think it's, i leave it on all the time sometimes like i said if there's a beta or a new update i do find that this mod gets in the way and can cause crashing so be careful with that but so far so good i haven't really had any problems it is a client mod so if you go to subscribe to it it is a client only mod meaning that anybody that connects to your server will not have this mod available so you just got to be a little bit cautious with it that way that if somebody joins in they're like well i don't have it they have to just remember that okay anybody connecting to the server has to actually click subscribe to the mod as well i will put the mod description in uh the link below so if you guys don't want to click on it you can feel free to download it and then subscribe to it and then go into your game and make sure you enable it but uh that being said i hope you enjoyed this video get there um, next to a crock pot and make as many recipes as you want learn along the way and hopefully this mod will help you not accidentally make the wrong uh, ingredient uh, the the wrong recipe uh, so hopefully you have the right ingredients that you need but it's always fun to learn so start jamming away at the crock pot make whatever you need but at least now you'll know what you're going to be making every single time i will see you in the next video thanks again for watching